Hey guys, Gravender here. What's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Seven Days to Die. And uh, we are a very, 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 very far away from home. I, I've set my waypoint up uh, to uh, show where uh, we're at on the map here to go back home. And uh, I've decided instead of going into town and looking for uh, supplies... That I was just gonna, you know, let's let's go out and see if we can find anything. And oh, I took so many. I was out. I was on my mini bike at night, guys. I was on my mini bike at night, and it was freaky. So I, I ran into so many dead ends. Dead end. Dead end. I went around this way, and it's like, oh, that's just taking me back home. So, yeah. But something about that one path was just like, hey travel me so I, I did I traveled it and we've got a friend down here and I think we're just gonna pop her off like that and she's gone I think there's someone else around I'm not too worried about it we spent we spent so much time Ooh, don't fall. That would be a bad day. We spent so much time just getting to this point. I want to turn that off. That's driving me insane. We spent so much time just getting to this point. I hope they're not inside. Because I believe that this is a shotgun Messiah. I know I hear that sucker. Oh, it's a bunny. I was like, there he is. No, it's a rabbit. I want to stick this stuff in here, though. Because I want room. The whole point of coming out on this whole big journey was to, uh... To loot some stuff, man. I didn't, like, come this far from home. Just to end up with some old rotten sham sandwiches. But I know this guy's somewhere around here. This is the edge of town, thank God. This place was actually pretty huge. I don't see how that guy could be inside. Gunpowder. Where are you? He can't be inside the building. There's no way. There's there's no... There's, there's absolutely no entry points that he could have got in. Not that I see, at least. He's not busted any holes through the wall. So how... Where is this dude at? He... I swear to God, if he's inside. That's gonna be messed up. Oh, we got metal. Metal. Wood. He sounds like he's inside. He is inside! How did you get inside? That's like a Houdini. That is a Houdini, man. Is he the only one? I don't hear anything else. Okay, let's uh, let's see what we can find here. So, I mean, it would just be like a, wa a completely wasted trip if I didn't actually hang around. It's like, I was so far out, and when night fell, it was like, you know what? Screw it. We're just gonna we're gonna ride it out, and uh, we're gonna see what we can find. Cause I mean, I'd already gone so far. It's not even funny anyway. So I want to find everything that I possibly can. I would love love to find a working stiff in this town if there is one. I I've, I've, I haven't searched everything yet in this town. I thought it was a lot smaller than it is. It's actually pretty decent size. So there's still this down through here that I can explore down through here that needs to be done. And just that corner, really. Um, but I would love... I want to find some auger parts, man. That's that's the big thing. Like, I found a little subtown on the way here. Uh, shotgun shells, yes. Uh, hello? Let's drop that. Uh, I don't need it. It's it's useless and I can't scrap it, so it's it's pointless. Um, 
But I found a little subtown, and it's they had a uh, had a bank in it, right? So I'm like, okay, I've never. Oh, why do I? I hate when I accidentally use that stuff. Um, I've never, I've never like uh, checked out a bank before. This town has a bank in it too, but I've never really checked out a bank before because. Like I didn't, I didn't really know what to expect. Whenever I actually got into the uh, into the vault, and I was thoroughly, thoroughly disappointed. Um, I guess it's it's really chancing up to the the fates of the uh, seven days to die gods. What you're actually going to get out of things, but uh, I was really expecting a lot more from nine mini uh nine mini vaults when i got in there it was nine of these uh wall safes in the wall and uh there was there was crap in them like seriously it was just it was it was mostly i don't think i kept anything to be honest i think everything that i got out of that wall those nine wall safes inside the vault and the six that were outside most of it just got scrapped. It was it was all scrap. I don't. Uh, I just. I don't know, guys. I just. I felt like I wasted like six or seven hours of in-game time, and that that right there does not help at all. Like all this stuff, it's it's mostly just stuff that I can't use because everything that I have is is better. Uh, if it's not purple, I'm not keeping it. So, I'm going to break down everything here. Everything's getting broke down. I'm, I'm going to... Why do I keep repairing stuff? Ugh. You're getting dropped. Scrap. 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 It's because that's all it is to me. It's all scrap right now. Uh, which I mean, it, the metal comes in handy. It really does. But you're not. What are you actually getting? Right? You know? I mean, like, I could, I could easily get more. I need. I need to see if I can actually get some. Yes. Because I, I, like a dummy. That thing's breaking down fast too. Uh, like a dummy, I ran off. Yeah, there's there's exactly what I need. The roving horde. Thankfully, my mini box right here. Um, like a dummy, I ran off and left my wrench at home, and I don't have the parts on me to make a spare wrench, so I'm just kind of screwed in that that whole aspect of it. But this is the the outside little area that I have not fully explored yet so I'm hoping keeping my fingers crossed because I think there was a there was a bank and a crappy shamway I know there's a lot of people out there that are probably like thinking shamways are are awesome and they they probably are like if you find a shamway in the very beginning of the game and you don't have a lot to eat uh, it's gonna come in pretty handy I would say but I've got tons of food I don't. I don't know if you've seen my stash of potatoes, but I have tons of potatoes. Like I don't. Uh, I don't need a shamway. I don't. I need a working stiff, and I need auger parts. That's what I need. And um, there's not going to be one in this town. I don't think. I think we are completely out of luck. I think that's the end. Yeah. What haven't I explored in this town? Well, there's there is this this area here, but it's like there's no road. So I mean, is it just is it just this like little crapped out area? I mean, that's what it looks like. It's just a little crapped out area with no road in it, and uh, there's not going to be any storefronts, I don't think. I mean, we could, uh, there's still more to it, okay, is there going to be a little offshoot road here, no, because of the cemetery, 
there what in the crap this this town has more cemeteries in it than any other town I've ever been in there are cemeteries on top of cemeteries here that is kind of freaky it's a little bit strange so I don't uh, Wow, look at all the friggin' cemeteries, man. I need, I need this. There's nothing in it. Okay, but I do need it. I need it for the gas. It's not giving me a lot of gas, but it's, it's gonna, it's gonna be more than what I had. We're gonna have to actually find some more. Get this one up here. Hello, lady. She's trying to get out to get at me, but she's not going to have any luck. I'm going to be gone by the time she gets out. I'm trying to find cars, woman. I'm trying to find cars. I don't need you up my butt. A zombie up my butt would actually be kind of, uh, kind of insane. I don't even I don't even know what to do I don't I don't know I'm at a loss here I think that's the way I came in it is that is the way I came in um, there's there's nothing really I mean, this is just there are some nice houses here but it's like what's that really do for me you know uh, it's not like these aren't the nice houses don't get me wrong don't uh, don't think that one ounce, these are not the nice houses. These are uh, fairly better houses than some of the other ones that we've seen in the game so so far. But uh, these are not the nice houses I was, I was talking about. There are some uh, a little bit better looking houses in the uh, general area. Not in this general area. This is like... This is the shitty part of town, but uh, if, if there are shitty parts of town anymore in uh, in a post-apocalyptic zombie wasteland, uh, but they're better they're better looking than these. That one's not that one's not too awful. I mean, compared to the other ones. Uh, so I mean, we're really just kind of sightseeing at this point, right? I want to see if there is a uh, wall safe. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for airdrops that I'm never going to get again. I want to see if there is a uh, safe up here. Oh, there's a crack of book. That was the other thing. But it's like, I don't really know too many things now that I don't know. So it's like crack of books are really kind of pointless at this point. Jump on the blocks. Come on. You can get up there. There you go. Ooh, it's a bag. Okay, that makes things a lot easier. Um, more kind of useless stuff. I mean, it's, it's, not, it's not better than the one that I have on. So it's kind of garbage that's just going to get scrapped. I mean sucks really see the one I got on 600 so it's like what's the point you know <laughs> what's what's the absolute point at this point um, so I guess we're just we're just basically gathering fuel so that we can go back home uh, I, I don't know exactly what I want to do <laughs> about getting home because it's getting later and later the more we stay here as it is anyway um, I'm pretty much just trying to get enough, uh, fuel. How are all these zombies getting inside, man? That is so crazy that they're all just kind of inside. And he's just kind of juking and jiving around there. 
I mean, there is kind of that, that little radio tower kind of place there at one of these buildings. Those uh, That's where I set up my base in one of my other games for the longest time. And there's another bank. And I'm not even going to bother. <laughs> as much luck as I had with that other bank. Yeah, no, sorry, thank you. Not happening. But there's, there is like a Shamway around here too somewhere. And it's, I think, I think there's a Shamway. Maybe it was the... I think it's down here beside the bank, but uh, yeah, I don't really care too much for Shamways, you know? The the Shotgun Messiah was the best thing in this town as far as I, I can tell, and, and really now it's just a matter of, of uh, getting back home. And there's a lot of burnt area. I gotta, gotta remember, because it only takes two swings on these cars. But I, I don't really want to get out in the middle of nowhere and uh, run out of uh, run out of gas. Be a bad day. And I, I did see the lady, so don't worry. I did see her coming. There's more of them. Okay. We got a berserker coming at us too. I hate that I'm destroying so many of these cars though. It's 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 really kind of at this stage in the game destroying a car um, and not getting anything out of it's really kind of sickening to me because of the fact that you know I know if I had a wrench that uh, I would be able to, to do so much more with it. So that that to me is just a tiny bit uh, sickening, and it does leave a little bit of a bad taste in my mouth, but. I mean, really, there's nothing else I can do because of the fact that, you know, I, I messed up and I forgot my wrench at home. And it's, it's just another pickaxe. So we're just, you know, we're doing what we can. I've got a bad, bad feeling that we're going to end up uh, back out here in the middle of the night trying to uh, find our way back home. And... There's not a lot I can do about that either, but that's just the way things are. So, we're heading home now. Uh, didn't really find much of anything good in that town. Um, I'm, re I'm really hoping that things start respawning soon back in the, uh, the main hub town. Because I am, I'm desperately needing that auger, man. That, that auger would come in so handy that it's not even funny for uh, for just about anything really. And then we're into the burnt. There was so much burnt area. Like I know I'm gonna run into it. That's I don't remember too much of this grainy area. Um, still trying to keep an eye out for. For nitrate too because you're in some there's a mountain climbing elk there that's kind of cool we are in some uh, desperate need of nitrate I mean, that's kind of why I wasn't using a gun as much as I probably should have been I don't think I've used a gun any on this trip at all in and out uh, two days I haven't used it trying to keep an eye out for that there are so many elk and pig and all kinds of other stuff. I know you guys watching this, you're like, you're probably spotting like nitrate like out the, the wazoo right now. And I just, I'm not seeing anything because it's hard to pay attention. You all get to have like a better vantage point than I do. I have found a lot of coal. Like right there, there's more coal right there. But I haven't found any white, man. I need the white stuff. I need that powder for my fix so that I can start crafting some more friggin gunpowder because I've got plenty of coal at the house our base that's not an issue coal is definitely not an issue there is a tiny bit that's the other bad thing about nitrate is the fact that it just comes in little tiny little itty bitty tiny spurts I mean you get you don't get much of anything at all out of it. It's it's crazy. <coughs> Sorry, guys. I couldn't help that. Ooh. 
I think it's just the the weather here lately has been uh, the weather outside's frightful. It's not snowing or anything. Obviously, it's friggin' August and it's hot as balls out. But uh, it's more like pollen and stuff. Is that a patch right there? Yes, it is. It's like two swings. Ooh, three swings. That's that's pretty much all I ever find it in. I would love love to find like a big patch of it, like I do the coal. Cause there is tons of whenever I find coal, it's like literally like a thousand batch at once most of the time. It's 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 crazy. I do find that uh, there are a lot of spawns for coal and nitrate more on the borders too, like the border of biomes. Uh, that's that's a little thing that I have seen a lot and uh these burnt areas it's it's a lot easier to see white on black so bear i don't want to get caught out in this stuff man after after the feral stage kicks in but it is a lot easier to find uh nitrate powder in these burnt areas because of the fact that it's it's that white color on this black ground so but I just I don't like being here oh I'm on fire I'm on fire that's not good this is why I don't like this area drink 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 please drink oh my mini bikes on fire no I think I just parked in fire that wasn't a good thing Oh, this is why I don't like this area. It's hard to avoid it because there's fire friggin' everywhere, man. You can do your best to avoid it, but eventually you're going to hit the stupid stuff. I am doing my best to avoid it, but I don't know. I do, like I said, I do like this area for nitrate, which we haven't found any at all, period, so far, so... It's kind of like a bust, but it is easier to see it in these areas. Right now, really, I just want to get home, and thankfully we are out of the burnt area. For now. For now. I'm going to tell you right now, it's, we're probably going to go right back into the burnt area really quick. Oh, wait. Are we back at our main town? Oh, that didn't take long at all. It's the roads. Those the roads take so long to uh, to get around that it's not even funny. Oh, we are we're back home. I think I've actually got enough time because there is a shamway. And there is the waterworks. We might actually be able to see if we can loot uh, one of these places down here. Like I know it's close to the house so we're gonna go down this way and this sh road here should take us to where the uh, the shotgun massages are and the cracker books at least I'm hoping it does we'll see but yeah it, uh, it definitely nope must be the next street down I know it's the street where the uh, there's snow and then it's like not snow and I know it's down through here let's see I'm gonna pop off the back and look at the map real quick yep yep it's just down this way just a tiny bit more we've got time to actually go look all I really do is I go to the windows and I just look in the window at one of the uh, filing cabinets and uh, check and see if, if I can actually loot anything out of it I'm actually glad we made it back and had gas to be able to do that um, well, that shopping carts that stuff in it. Let's see what can I get rid of here. That right there can be scrapped. I think I just didn't scrap a lot of this stuff because we were kind of in a hurry to leave and get back to the, the house. But I know I've got room for a lot of this stuff. 
in here. So let's go ahead and just dump all of this in there that we can. I don't have leather in there. That's crazy. The best thing that came out of this whole trip is the nitrate powder. As sad as that is. Uh, but really, that's 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 what we that's what we got. Let's go check this real quick. Yeah, see, it's it's still. I think this was the first place that I hit up though. So um, maybe because this one down here, I don't uh, I don't remember this one respawning again. So maybe we'll get lucky. That's still all empty, man. Empty. I I feel like that the time for this to respawn has come and gone. And I do not remember for the life of me, I do not remember going back to these places uh, a second time. So it's it's really kind of disheartening that there's nothing there. So this was just it was a wasted busted trip. Like I don't I don't know how many how many um, supply drop crates that I've I've went and found and how many uh, working stiffs and shotgun massage and just about anything else you can think of that I have looted at this point and I haven't found the first bit of auger stuff I really haven't and and my my scavenging is maxed out and my quality Joe is maxed out too so it's really kind of it's really kind of disheartening that you can't craft that kind of stuff. But it is good to be back home after being left out in the middle of nowhere for a full day, of almost a full two days now. It is it is absolutely good to be home. Those are kind of wonky looking. And it doesn't look like anybody's been here, so that's a good sign too. Um, everything's finally cleared out. We're going to die. Oh, God, we're going to die. And I know I'm going to get it again jumping back through. Oh, well. I've got, like, it's, it's not being wasteful. It's really not. <laughs> you guys have no clue. It's it That is absolutely not being wasteful. I can tell you that much right now. Uh, that was, screw it. I'm going to leave it on. Um, that's not being wasteful. Because, look. <laughs> I have so many first aid kits that it's not even funny. That's how many. Like, all of those, every last one of those has come from a supply drop as far as I can remember. I don't remember them getting... I don't remember getting them anywhere else, to be honest. And, uh... You know, that's that's a... That's a frick ton of supply drops. So, it's that's why it's really disheartening to kind of go out and, uh go on a scavenger run and not get crap man I did want to put enough stuff in here to uh, keep going because I, I figured I would be gone overnight and a 2,000 stacks have held up pretty good those are just blowing my mind that they look like they're in the snow biome and they're in the desert biome <laughs> oh, don't get on the bike I just need to empty it we just need to empty it. But I mean, like, we found some decent stuff. It's not the best stuff in the world. We really didn't get a lot of good stuff on this trip at all. I, I'm thoroughly, thoroughly disappointed. And I, I really feel like, aside from opening up the map more, that this trip was just kind of pointless. Um, so I need to find some better stuff. And it's like, I am branching out so much that it's not even funny at this point. This was just like a little one house town. I know I hit another little one house town here. I don't know where to go now at this point. I don't know. That right there looks like, which we didn't fully explore this road down here it looks like. We didn't go all the way down. So there could have been, there could have been something better down there. Probably wasn't. There probably wasn't, but I mean, you, you're, you'll never know. You'll never know. We'll never know at this point because I don't know if I'll go back. I mean, that, sh that shot right there actually didn't take very long. Because you got to think, 
This is the way we came home. Right here. Just a straight shot all the way across to uh, to our hub city. Right? This is the way I went. We went here. Actually, no. This is the way I went. I went this way and went straight down to here. And then I connected up at this road. Because I wanted to take that road because I thought that road looked cool. Because it kind of dipped down. It went off to the side and dipped down. So I went this way. And I came here. And dead end. And I went here. And it was a little rinky dink town. And I, thankfully I picked the right way here. So we went there. I picked this road to keep continuing on with it. It zigzagged and did all this other bull crap. And then I came to this junction. And I turned right. And I went straight. And I did all this zigzag and bull crap and ran out of road. So I had to turn around and come back. And then I went this way and I went that way. All this whole time burning, burning zombies were chasing me. And those two were dead ends. So I had to come all the way back down here. And then I followed the road to this town. So that was a journey and a half to say the least. It really was. It looks like these two towns may connect up here via this road. So, I mean, if I would have chose this road down here instead of that road, it would have uh, it would have took me straight to it. I'm a guessing it would have. I'm not positive, but I think it would have taken me straight to it. But for some reason, that road right there just kind of piqued my fancy. So that's the way I went. So, really, the only options that I have now is to come down here and explore off of this road and see where this way goes, because I don't think I've, I've really explored anything past that on the map as it is now anyway. So, we've got that. We've got these two roads here, which I think this one here just connects back up to this one. And then this will connect down here to, uh, to this. And then there's this road here that offshoots and goes somewhere. I mean, we've still got a lot we can do. The map is absolutely huge. We haven't even tipped the uh, the iceberg, the tip of the iceberg, as far as that goes with this kind of stuff. But I don't know. I don't know where to go. I want to keep building on my base, too. Like, I want to build on my base. I want to explore. I want to find stuff. I need an auger, man. I need an auger. I may try and see what this if this road connects to that one. And then I may go check out this down here because now we know that we can actually get to that town in one day. It actually took two days to get there. It took two days to be able to get to that town and do anything. So that kind of stunk uh, going all the way around and all this other rigmarole that we had to go do. But I think I'm going to do that in the next episode maybe. Or I might do that off camera. I think I might do that off camera and see if we can find anything good. But... All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for listening to me ramble. Hopefully you guys enjoy the rambling. It's it's not too bad sometimes, I don't think. I, I love this game. I enjoy it quite thoroughly. Hope you guys are enjoying it, too. I'm standing really, really close to uh, to my furnace right now. So uh, that's not going to... That's going to bode well. I'm seeing how hot it's getting. I'm standing right next to the forge, man. So, all right, guys. That's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Random lightning, thunder. I hate it whenever you come back into the game. But thank you guys so much for watching. If this is the first time watching the channel and you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a sub on it. If you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a like on it. And as always, guys, remember to like, share, comment, subscribe. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.